Hey folks, Phil Beeman here. I'm gonna do a product review today. I've got what I'm gonna call the Super Shaker. This is like a, a cordless B frame shaker. And it came, uh, I ordered this off of Alibaba. I was expecting a, just a modified jigsaw, but it's actually built pretty heavy. It's a pretty solid chunk of iron there. And then these, uh, these little grips are triggered with the handle. And then once you get the battery on, it shakes like that. It came with two 20 volt batteries. They don't interchange with anything obvious that I have, but you do get it. It does have an indicator light on it. So that's handy, you know, when it's fully charged. And the fact that it's got two means you can probably run, run a full day. Okay, let's go give it a try. Okay, so the first step in this, and what I'm doing, by the way, is boosting weak hives. And I had the queen here. There she is. Real dark beauty. And so I'm going to say, I know where she is. She's going to stay there. And I'm going to shake two of these frames worth of bees into this colony, which is a little bit weak. And I have that empty box there to kind of be a bit of a funnel. And let's try this out. So I grab the frame, squeeze, and pull. And then shake. It dumps quite a chunk of bees in there pretty well. Um, it's not too hard. It's, it doesn't shake you as much as I thought it might. It seems fairly well built. You can uh, focus in here on the, the label there. So, and I ordered it off of Alibaba. Uh -huh. I probably want some Loctite on one of these nuts here. already and I've only used it a few times so this one's capped that one wasn't for some reason uh, so anyway that would compare to it I'll show you how I would shake a frame These, this high is gonna get lots of bees so I would shake it like that and you get on you get pretty much all the bees off but I find if I'm doing that all day my wrists get a little sore so and I think also if you're wearing gloves, the fact that that thing grabs the frame also is probably the advantage. Mm -hmm. So we're just working away here, finding weak hives and boosting them. These hives, because it's been so cold, um, their brood area is quite small for their population, so I can shift bees to another hive without you know, losing brood uh, on the hive that you're taking them from few more warm nights and that brood nest on these hives will grow quite a bit and then there won't be any bees to spare in the same way so I kind of got to get this done while I can. Uh, that's it for today. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.